The Roman Empire has come to conquer the collection. Hey, it's Wrestling Hero Figs. All these right here, they're all just about done, you guys. A lot of these are customs. They are fix-ups. The ones that you're seeing on the back right here, these are all the basics that have uh, received the elite treatment. The ones up front, those are the ones that have been converted. So these are kind of like the leftover parts. The ones that I couldn't do anything about were the ones that had the molded on vest. As you can see on this one right here, on the gold attire, I think that one came in a battle pack with either it was Braun Strowman or John Cena. And that goes the same for these two. These two are almost identical. This one was from the battle pack and this one was its own individual release. That one right there... That's from the uh, three pack, which was the, what was it? The then now forever Walmart exclusive. Those are the only once shield characters that we got that had those masks that you can remove and take off. Over here, this one, this is from Elite Se or Basic Series 90 and another one that's got the molded on vest. Now that we've covered the ones that I couldn't do anything about, the ones that have received the fix ups, I'll show you. First one up right here, the one that I still have yet to do. Um, this one is from the best of 2014. So I do plan on still doing this one into an elite. Uh, obviously, as you can see, the blue outline that you're seeing on the vest, it's also carrying on through the actual pants themselves. So once I do the fix up on this one, I'm going to have to go and uh, do the touch up on the actual pants themselves. Because none of these right here that you're seeing, none of them did get that blue outline. The NXT TakeOver, this one was the early days. Roman Reigns, this one had got the fix i had to do it man i think out of all the roman Re reigns head scans that we've gotten the one that we got right here oh, and i'll show you because i did put it on an old fodder piece that i used to convert into an elite that's it that's the actual scan that we got and i do prefer this one i know this is roman in later days but the guy never really changed his overall look unless he got the full-on beard as you can see later on this one was his first elite actually elite series 26 was the very first time that they had uh, introduced him into the elite wave before it was into a three pack it was a basic three pack but this one did it for me man i think the way that they got the vest right i mean his vest eventually did get more designs as you can see this was more like cargo pockets eventually later days when they made the return he did kind of bring this look back elite series 26 so that, that one was Elite Series 20, 26. Well, the Elite Series 38, which is kind of the same thing that you're seeing right here for Elite Series 56, it was the white. That one I ended up using. So right now it's on a basic. The actual vest itself, it's on a basic because I ended up using um, my Elite Series 38 to convert it into one of these. And you'll understand why. Once I show you the conversion, you'll see. But this one right here, this was from Elite Series 56. And the only one, too, that had the white outsoles. I mean, he only wore it once. You know, there was a lot of issues backstage because of the reason why he didn't do it again it was yeah vince mcmahon he didn't like it shield three pack this was off the shield three pack not the then now forever but the epic moments this one had uh multiple shirts actually come to think of it my elite series 38 that i ended up using was to convert it into just i really like the shirts man see it's like the look of it all it's just so different i think something about the shirts gave it a little extra touch so i wanted to make sure that one of um my Elite Series 38 had that. So, you know, you got the Superman punch over here, and you got the Shield Reunion shirt on this one over here. Now, Elite Series 65, this is the one that's going to get, well, not just 65. I know Elite Series 68 is also going to get interchangeable hands. On that one, he's got the Superman punch. On this one, we got the Hang Loose hands, and they said it was 3D print on, on this one, but I still don't see it, you guys. You know, correct me if I'm wrong, but I just, this looks very similar to Elite Series 56, because if you look at a true print, like, like for example, um, this one was Elite Series 62. Here's a comparison. As you can see on this one, this one you can actually see like shading on the beard, on the eyes. I'm not seeing it with this one, man. But it was still cool that we got the red one because the one thing that I could not wait out of all these Roman Reigns re-releases was the red attire. And I'll tell you, and I'll show you this one right here. This is this is kind of Hero Fix Patience. So this one I had gotten from the Battle Pack. I think it was the Bray Wyatt Battle Pack. This one came with the red vest, and I wanted the red one, man. I wanted it so bad. So I was pretty stoked to get this one in Elite Series 65. But this one had to get converted. And I also did a head swap right here from the three or the three pack, which was the shield epic moments. So I put the head scan on that one. I put the vest. This one might be my favorite. It's a toss-up, man. It's a toss-up between this one and the Toys R Us exclusive. The Toys R Us exclusive, if you put it side by side with uh, Elite Series 62, they're almost like identical. I mean the gold. Not the actual print of the Superman Punch logo right there, but the gold right there. These are the two golden tires and the basic this one the basic and um 
Elite Series 62, these are kind of like almost the same thing except in Elite Figure form. But the Toys R Us exclusive, this one was hard to get a hold of. It never hit my Toys R Us, and I don't know why. I ended up finding this one off, I think it was off eBay. Now, Elite Series 45, I know there was a lot of. This one was the one figure that was all over the place. Like, out of Elite Series uh, 45, the hardest one that I couldn't find was the Seth Rollins, which was the white attire. Now, this one did come with the WWE title. Um, the scan, I think that's the, the original one. I don't, I'm, I'm almost, yeah, I'm pretty sure that I haven't done the swap on that one. I really like that one overall. Now, Elite Series, I think it was, yes, 51. The blue one, it's Elite Series 51 with Hero Fix touch up with more of a, a nicer scan. I, again, this one I'd gotten from one of the basic figures that they started doing the print on. So, this is really the only thing that I did to it was add the, ha uh, the mask. Now, this next one right here, this is kind of like an overall. Like custom fix up of it all. This was the return. This is like him bringing back the old shield attire. This this vest right here. I'm gonna tell you this, man. You might have seen multiple unboxing videos on this like specific basic. This from well, it's not a basic, not this figure, but the the vest that I got this from. This came off um, a basic, and I think it was also the best of 2014. I needed this not only for the Roman Reigns return when they brought back the shield attire on the on the last run, but also for the Triple H Shield custom. This was the, the look and style of it all. The next one right here, this one was also a fix-up. This one came off the uh, basic series. I think it was uh, 81. I know these two right here. This one was such a tough choice because we got uh, two similar looks right here in the basic figure line. But, you know, I, I don't know. I don't know what it was, man. I just think the brighter orange this deserved, like, the elite treatment. I think that one gave it a better look to it. So it was a tough. Now, this next one right here, the one that I, the last one that I want to do, there's still, like, two or three that I want to get converted into elite. But one that's definitely on the list is the battle pack that came with AJ Styles which is a dark brown attire. I mean, all in all, I think there's still about like, I would say about five or six that I want to get converted. Like I said, I can't do anything about the ones that have to mold it on vests, but this is it, you guys. This is the Roman Reigns collection. We got the pile over here, the pile that we just ran through. Big dog man, stoked, man. This guy right here, you know we're going to see a lot of him. Like, they're Roman Reigns, he's far from done. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Be sure to hit the subscribe button if you're new to the channel, and we'll see you on the next one.